Hey, what's going on, ladies and gents? It's your friend, Neighbor Content Creator. I wanted to make a video of why I am pretty glad that I did not summon Yai Miko. And let me just explain myself before a lot of you guys let me know in the comments why it doesn't matter if I summoned or not. As you may know, I already summoned Yai Miko on my main account so I could try her out, see how she plays, you know, do some content on her. And I personally really do enjoy Yai Miko and she, you know, has an impact in my account generally. But I'm really glad that I didn't summon her on this account in specific. Now, Yaimiko has a lot of, you know, benefits to your team where you can, you know, place her as a sub DPS. She can be your, you know, main DPS, whatever it is. I'm just really glad that I didn't summon on her because of one specific reason. And that specific reason is pretty dreamlike. I've seen a dream about a certain character that's uh, not out yet. And this dream made me so happy that i didn't summon on yaimiko that i already want to start farming for this individual now i've seen no it's not a like a lot i've just seen like a little bit because it was just in my face on the recommended page on youtube so it just the first thing i seen and i had to look at it i don't know why i had to but i did and i watched it and to be honest i'm sort of glad now i i'm really excited about this next character that's going to be coming out and pretty much am st i'm starting to farm i'm you know the artifact set for this domain you know the heart of depth even though i have some for tartaglia here that are insane as you guys can see they're pretty good but maybe i can get some other ones that can be good as well and at the same time i can upgrade my tartaglia if i have a really good one but as you guys can see, I don't have the best ones. This one's pretty good. But the crit damage rolls that I got were not that great. You'll see it on the screen. I'll show it to you guys. But yeah, I'm really excited for this character. And I cannot wait to actually try out this character in the future. And have him on this account. So I'm pretty glad that I, you know, held off on summoning on Yaimik on this account. And maybe now I can focus on that character and what that character and bring to the table now in general i do not have any good weapon for him so i do have this one the aminoma kagechi this weapon might be good on him i don't know it's just the only weapon that has you know decent attack percentage that i kind of want to use uh, on like any of these i don't think i would use physical damage on it at all so i don't know perhaps i could use the ala flash but the ala flash is you know it's bennett's weapon and uh, yeah, I'm, I, I don't know. I might have to even summon on the weapon banner to see if I can get his weapon. So pretty much I tried to summon for Ganyu in the past. So I did the thing with myself where if I got Ganyu, I would, you know, use that and keep saving. If I didn't, I would have to actually summon on the next character, right? Maybe uh, I thought of Yai Miko or thought of, you know, Kamisato Ayato. And... I'm sort of glad. So I got Jean. And if you guys don't know, Jean was my first 5 star on this account. And what happened is I got Jean there. And I got Jean on the standard banner as well. So now I have my Jean at C2, which is pretty insane. I think she's my only standard banner character on here. Yeah, she is. My, my Jean is pretty stacked now. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really excited for Kamasata Ayato. And I cannot wait to try him out. So I have the situation where I'm pretty much guaranteed Ayato if I want to summon on him. So if I do, you know, end up summoning on him, I'll use the rest of the gems to try to get his weapon. But I only have one shot to get his weapon. So let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of that. If you think that's a good idea, let me know. If you don't, also let me know in the comment section. I really do appreciate all the support and love you guys have shown my channel recently. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in the next video very soon. Goodbye.